It is now uh, 6 16 on this uh, Tuesday night. Thinking of wonderful things, think Betsy Kling's going to make us smile as well? She always does, doesn't she? Well, <laughs> sometimes, anyway. Most of the time. <laughs> this time of year. I think hey. a lot depends yeah, so. on if somebody comes to the door during our, our 5 o'clock show, somebody came and knocked on the door. I'm in my living room, and I was like, I don't know what I'm supposed to do if I'm supposed to answer it. <laughs> and we get to the break, and I was like, actually, it would have been pretty boss if Santa Claus like rolled up to my door and knocked. And I had like this surprise guest, right? Wouldn't that have been cool? That and my been kids cool. are at my right. parents' house, so they would have absolutely been just, oh, Santa's at our house and we're not even there. <laughs> like, it just would have been amazing. However, it was the gas company. So let's get on with this forecast, everybody. We do have a nice night on tap as far as winter standards go. And remember, we are in winter right now. It is officially winter uh, after that winter solstice hit this morning at 1059. Temperatures tonight are going to be dropping back into the 20s for the start of the day tomorrow. But right now we're sitting pretty in the mid and upper 30s. It is going to be a bit breezy, though, so it will feel even colder than it actually is. We are mostly clear across northeast Ohio, but the clouds are rolling our way and those clouds are associated with a cold front that will come through later tonight. As the front drops in, we may see a few pop up showers, rain and or snow, more likely the snow side than the rain. Uh, and it does not look like we're going to have to deal with any accumulations out of that. It'll be a really quick hit as this moves through. More notably, though, it is the leading edge of much colder air. So as we go through the day tomorrow, I think you're going to notice it doesn't feel as warm as it did today. Today we had sunshine and 40s. Tomorrow we have clouds and wind and 20s. So a notable distinct difference is coming in. As we go through the overnight in your uh, National Design Mart hour by hour forecast, there's about the timing of the front. You can see those scattered snow showers around, maybe a little rain mixed in at times, but the midnight temperatures are going to be in the mid 30s. We'll drop back into the low 30s very early morning, and then tomorrow morning we start in the 20s. But here is the key with that northwest wind continuing to drive in that chilly air. I really don't think we're going to be moving out of the 20s. So once we are in the 20s, we're going to stay there. And you can see the wind gusts there too. Wind gusts up over 30 miles per hour at times, a possibility tomorrow. The good news is amongst the clouds, we will get to see some sun peaks, especially in the afternoon tomorrow. Then once we get into the latter part of the day, the temperatures are going to continue to fall off. So tomorrow night, we're probably looking at temperatures down into the low and mid 20s. And it really doesn't look like we have a huge warm up coming yet. We actually have some warmer temperatures that are going to start to slide in here. Let's go ahead and jump ahead to your Union Home Mortgage Outlook, because this is where things really kind of start to spread out as far as the forecast goes. We're going to have a lot of clouds around on Thursday, but the temperatures are going to start moving back toward the 40 degree mark. A warm front will pass through. That may kick up a few showers, but I really think we're looking at 50 degrees or so for Friday, which is Christmas Eve, and Christmas Day with rain chances moving in too. So something to keep in mind for church services if you go either day. By Kwanzaa on Sunday, we're in the low 40s, so a little cooler, mostly cloudy skies still with us. A little rain snow chance on Monday with temperatures in the mid 40s. It doesn't look like we have any uh, massive storms setting up for next week either. So right now, it really looks like it's just rain that we have to contend with. Yeah, we're smiling Russ. here, Betsy. This isn't too bad. Yep, we can do it. All right, we can do it. Side of the gas man for us, too, by the way. <laughs>